Hello and welcome to Let's Set Com Tutorials by Team Letex. In this video, we'll do a brief walkthrough of the Let's Set Com dashboard. So as you can see, this is your dashboard. This is your overall stats, the total campaigns that you have created, total clicks and the total views that you have generated. In the next section, these are the four steps. First one is set up domain profile, set up Let's Set Com Pixel and create the campaign and then trigger the campaign. In the next section, there are last 30 day statistics and in the section then after, there are last few campaigns. Now in the campaigns tab, you will find all the campaigns that you have created. From here, you can edit the campaign, you can also clone it from here, you can find the reports here and then you can also archive it. If you wish to pause the campaign, you can do it simply from here. Now you can also cl create cloned links from here in the links tab. Now in the library, you can simply upload any image or a video by simply from here. Now in the settings tab, there are six, six sections. First one, domain profile, wherein there is the name of the website, your account a private key, then account domain. You can add the domains from here and can delete them by simply clicking on the cross icon. And then there is default time zone and then you can also remove the brand name. In the white label domain, you can add the domain by clicking here. In the next section, users, you can add the users by clicking here. In the smart booklet, we provide you a Let's Set Com smart bookmarklet with the help of which you can find export to any element of your website. Now in the pixel, this is the pixel that you need to place in the head tag of your website. You can also use WordPress plugin. You need to simply click on this in order to download the wordpress plugin and you have to simply upload it in your wordpress then shopify if you want to add any store you can simply add it from here in case you want to use any shopify express plugin you can do it simply by following the steps over here thank you